Okay, so let's talk about effective age of your home. Why does it matter and what is it? So the effective age of your home is what's gonna be reflected on your city assessed tax value. So it's the age that your, your property was built. Now, what changes is if you do renovation. Now, the question is how much renovation does the effective age actually get changed with the city? So it's not just a cosmetic renovation. So for example, you replace a kitchen, you're gonna put in uh, you know, new vanities, lights, floors, deck, your, the effective age of your home is not going to change there. If you do a massive renovation, for example, it can be considered to change if you bumped up a bungalow, which I live in, and throw on a second story. Possibility. If you tear down the house, keep the original foundation, which has done a lot in destination neighborhoods like I live, and you build on that because it's a lot cheaper to maintain that original foundation and then build the house above it, the effective age of your home can change. So why does that matter? The reason that it matters is because your taxes will change because then your taxes would reflect a 2022 home as opposed to a 1956 bungalow.